Hey folks, it's Troy here with another uh, review of some great stuff that we have in our used department. Um, we continually get a great variety of used film and digital cameras and lenses and accessories and stuff. And uh, if you're looking for something in specific out there, you should give us a call or stop by the store and see if we have it. So for today, I've got... I've got four lenses and four cameras I want to show off to you, and I think they are all pretty darn special. So, let's get into it. Uh, first up, for Canon EF users or Canon R users who are uh, converting, adapting their lenses to Canon R mount, we have the beautiful Canon, uh, what is it here, EF 100mm f2.8 LIS macro lens. So, uh, this is Canon's, you know, premium macro lens, the 100-8 with image stabilization. It is selling for just $635. Uh, it's a great lens. Whether you're using it for close-ups or maybe using it as a portrait lens, uh, this thing will knock you out. It is so darn sharp. It's amazing. Uh, if you're a Canon user, you might want to come and check that out. Uh, if you are a Nikon user, I have a couple special lenses as well. There is this, the uh, Tamron 35 1.4 SP lens. Uh, this was their anniversary lens to celebrate their designation of the SP lens as the superior performance lenses. Uh, I've spoken with a couple of our local photographers who have gotten this lens and they have nothing but superlatives to say about it. Uh, I've gotten to use it a bit as well and I too think it's stunning. If you've ever wanted uh, a 35 1.4 that is, you know, hands above the rest, uh, if you're a Nikon user, you got to consider this. This 3514 SP is selling for $600. Also for Nikon users, uh, if you are somebody who likes exceptional lenses, you know that symbol. You know what Zeiss is about. Color fidelity, sharpness, micro contrast. Uh, these guys deliver. And here we have for the Nikon F mount, a 15 millimeter, 15 millimeter ultra wide with a maximum aperture of 2.8. This is selling for $1,400. The focus on it is so smooth. It does have uh, the electronic contacts on the back, so it will talk with the uh, with the camera you mounted on. Uh, this one too, I have gotten to play with a little bit, and yeah, it's glorious. If you are into landscape photography and the like. You should consider this. Uh, use it on your Nikon film camera, use it on your Nikon DSLR, or adapt it to a Z camera. You will not be disappointed. Um, finally, for the uh, four showcase lenses today, uh, I've got this neat one that I did not... I did not expect much from this. I mean, this, this lens is, was only made between 1960 and 1965. Uh, it's got a selling price of only 300 bucks. I mean, how good could this thing be? But I tell you this, uh, the Leica 135, Leica M 135 F4 uh, telephoto lens, this thing is kind of a knockout. In our modern age here, it's not much to look at. I admit that it only has a minimum focusing distance of five feet. You attach this to any modern uh, mirrorless camera and it sure is odd looking. But I tell you, as they say, the proof the proof is in the pudding. The proof is in the digital files, and I have gotten to use this lens. Again, a 135 f/4, selling for just 300 bucks. And this thing is sharp as a tack. Very sharp, beautiful long focus throw on it. Um, and yeah, it's kind of fantastic. So if you have a Leica M camera, film or digital, or if you want to adapt this to your modern mirrorless camera, again, like I said with some of the other lenses, you will not be disappointed. It's a beaut, and again, only 300 bucks. Come on. Uh, the four cameras I mentioned, uh, as you, if you've been keeping up with our stuff here and watching our videos and things, you know that it's mad hot film camera summer. So the cameras that I have to share with you today are all film cameras. Uh, there is the Electro, Electro uh, Yashica, uh, what is it here? Electro, Electro 35 from Yashica. Uh, basically a little aperture priority rangefinder with a, where is it here, with a 45 1.7 lens on it. This cutie is selling for just $120. That's pretty cool. We also have, look at this guy, the little Minolta Hymatic F. So this is basically a point and shoot camera that you have to focus by hand. Um, does not have any aperture or shutter speed controls. It is automatic exposure, but you still need to shoot and advance the film yourself, and focus it yourself as well. This neat little guy is selling for $110. Uh, 
and that has a uh, 38 millimeter 2.7 lens on it. Pretty darn special. Um, then two, two really nifty cameras left to share with you today yet. Uh, the first one is this, a beautiful Roliflex. Uh, this is a, what is it here, Rolif Roliflex 35F. So it has a Carl Zeiss 75 3.5 shooting lens on it, and uh, it's just really kind of beautiful. It's in great shape, and it's selling for $2,700. Now you might think, oh my gosh, that seems kind of high and pricey, but there's a reason for that because not only is the camera in excellent shape, but it comes with these two guys, which I personally have never seen before. So we have a twin lens reflex that comes with two, two lens adapters. So we have a 0.7 uh, lens adapter, so it makes the lens more wide angle. And then it also comes with a 1.5, 1.5 tele extender. So for that $2,700, you do get the beautiful camera and then the, the two lens adapters that come with it. These are quite rare, quite hard to come by and you get them all in one package for $2,700. So unique, I've never seen that before. Now, the final item of the day is one that I part uh, particularly um, I just geek out on it in a big way. Uh, I, I think Carl Zeiss lenses are just glorious and beautiful. And um, yeah, they're just they're just excellent stuff. So uh, so we saw a Zeiss there. Uh, we saw, was it here? Yes, we saw a Zeiss there. And then now, hoo we have the Contax. Contax RTS-3 with a uh, Carl Zeiss 51.7 planar on there. Um, the Contax RTS was Contax's professional like premium S film SLR. You can feel it in the weight. Uh, you can hear it in the sound of the shutter. It's just beautiful. This with the lens is selling for $775. Now what makes this camera very, very special is not apparent on the outside. It's on the inside of this camera. And what makes it so special is it's film plane. Uh, with this camera, this is the first time Contax ever did this back in the film day, where they put in a ceramic, a high pressure ceramic film plate that actually has a vacuum built into it. So when the film transports across the plane, it actually gets sucked tight against the film plane, so you get the flattest film possible, and therefore the sharpest image as possible with your Carl Zeiss lenses. Uh, I haven't seen one of these and used in a long time and this is, it's just kind of thrilling. Uh, I can't say enough good things about this camera or about the contact system in general. Uh, beautiful technology, beautiful build quality and excellent Carl Zeiss lenses. So if you really want a very special film camera, come in here and check this beast out. Again, that's selling for $775. Uh, thank you for paying attention here today, uh, nearly nearly nine minutes at this point here of uh, four exceptional lenses, four nifty cameras, and let us all continue to celebrate Mad Hot Film Camera Summer! And thank you for supporting local businesses. See y'all.